Welcome back to another On The Range video with Occam Defense Solutions. So I was at uh, Red October a couple weeks back and got to see a lot of shooters and these were people that love AKs and um, I was kind of blown away at some of the problems with the simple things. And um, so I wanted to go over a way of reloading. And uh, if you shoot a lot, you might have a different view on how to reload than I do. And I'm totally fine with that. Do whatever works for you. Um, but uh, some of the teaching that I've been most impressed with uh, is that which brings people who are on a low level up to a, a good level of proficiency quickly. And so I'm going to cover that method of reload that I think everybody should have in their pocket. And whether you use it or not is up to you. So the first thing is that when you grab a, a magazine, you're going to want to grab it like this with the pinky down here. That ensures that you are located. If you're up here when you grab a mag, that's a problem. The way it, the way that you know you're in a good spot is if that pinky is here. Now if you happen to grab a mag and it's here, no big deal. Swing it in, bang it against your hip bone and you're where you want to be. That gives you a the same, you're, it's like choking up on a bat the same way every time or a golf club the same way every time. So then the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to twist, I'm going to keep my head up and I'm going to twist the gun the, the port, the magazine port towards, or magazine well towards me. And then right here, I'm going to touch my knuckles to the, the handguard, and I'm going to tip it in, and then I'm going to pull straight back. Yep. Straight back like that. Then I'm going to reach around here, see how, how little bit of a motion this is? And I'm just going to take either my finger or my hand here, and run it hard back and let it go. When the gun malfunctions or it's for whatever reason it's time to reload, we're going to get that same grip and again if it's up high, we're going to hit it against our hip to get that view and then we're going to chop upwards and we're going to hit this this tab right here that's the magazine release and then we're just into the same thing. And you can do that with empty magazines anywhere in your house. You probably want to do it on carpet and, you know, don't ding up your nice wood floor. Make sure that your gun is empty and that your magazines are empty and that there are no bullets in the room, no cartridges in the room. Um, I have friends who are extremely competent shooters, and one of them recently had an ND with an AK because he was dry firing in his basement great place to be dry firing or dry practicing and he was pointing in the safe direction doing mag changes and he went click and things were good and then he went and he got a loaded magazine and he dangered the gun up again and then he went somewhere else came back to the room and said one more try kapow okay so when you're doing dry practice all the cartridges need to be in another room, and I like to say out loud, I am starting dry practice. My weapon is empty, and I'll check it twice, right? So when we're clearing a gun, we're going to look, look away, look again, and feel. That's the Paul Howe method where he looks twice. I like that a lot. And then we're going to check that both of our magazines are empty as well. I'm not going to show you these two because they're both hot, but that's the idea. No cartridges anywhere. Okay, so to recap, when we grab a mag, bump your hip, get the pinky, uh, knuckles to foreguard, pull straight back, run the slide. To change the mag, beer cran grip again, do that, kick it out. Okay. Another thing for good magazines, this is an X-Tech here, I really like them, they're brand new. Check out how much force you need. It's a little click, okay? You don't have to heave on it. Alright, Brian Keeney with Occam Defense. Thanks for watching, hope you found this useful.
If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and make sure that you click the notification bell. That will make you aware when we upload other videos, other product reviews. Occam Lube is in stock and shipping now and the pre-order for our Merck Free Float Handguard is still going on. Links to those products will be in the description of this video. Don't miss out.